His entire career, from the Chitlin circuit to the biggest venues, James Brown never took anything for granted. We had a show in Philadelphia, and for whatever reason, the local promoters said to add the Dells to the show. The Dells were a Temptations-type group that were very, very, very big in their early 70s. Amazing singers. They went on stage and just killed. Girls were standing on the seats and hollering and screaming and throwing panties at the lead singer. They were tearing the place apart. In the middle of their act, I go downstairs to the dressing rooms, and I see James outside his dressing room with Danny Ray. Danny Ray was Mr. Brown's personal valet and master of ceremonies, the man with the cape. James is with Danny, smoking a cigarette, pacing across the floor outside this hallway. This is totally out of character. Normally, he would be in the dressing room under a hair dryer with a robe just chilling. But he's dressed and pacing, and he was just muttering, fucking Dells, goddamn Dells. They had him. They had him in the palm of their hand. They're fucking idiots. That's why I don't want this shit on my show. They didn't know when to quit. They did what they came for, and now they're still up there singing that shit. Danny, go up there and pull him off the stage. Leave me not too long. Get him off stage. Get him off stage. Danny, go get him off. Get him off. Danny looked at me. I looked at him. We walked over towards the stage area, and I said, Danny, you can't, you can't do this. This place will riot. So we, Danny and I just disappeared. Just got the hell out of Dodge. <laughs> 